guys so uh, it's monday morning we're on our way to register the charity and buy supplies let's do this Parliament and we're basically in the city. What's this? Parliament City. We're on our way to register the company. Just sent um, the t-shirts to be printed. The traffic is just crazy. Not yet. Yeah, I can see it. That's how bus. We're on our way to Port Porto. Mm -hmm. And that's the soap in the car. Yeah, that's all the soap in the car and all our stuff, all our clothes and stuff. So we'll see you in Port Porto. We've got a really nice hotel and the view is pretty nice but we're going to go deep into the village and find out exactly what's going on over here and why there's so many people dying from malaria. Okay. Inside right now we've just seen a lady from Congo. She's a refugee that came to Uganda and she's just had a cesarean. She's in hospital. Her refugee camp is so far away and that's where her food is. She's got no food here. It's a public hospital so they don't give them food. She's got her baby next to her and we've just told her that we're going to come back tomorrow and give her the mosquito net, the blanket and the soap but she really wants food so hopefully we can try and bring food but obviously we can't promise that because we only have what we have so that's what's just happened in there mom she, she only speaks Swahili so my mom had to translate um, and speak to her so now we're gonna go and see someone else inside That lady, she hurt her back and she's pregnant and the ward is full so they've put her in the corridor. Mm -hmm. We're about to go into the maternity ward and see other people that are like pregnant or just have just had their baby. Yesterday with his wife, he had his wife's paralyzed on one side 
and she's in hospital. They're refugees from Congo. Um, so we've just given him the bag that we promised yesterday. We're going to go meet one of the nurses, the head nurses here. She's going to take us around too. She thinks we need our stuff and then we're going to hand it to them. So now the nurse is going to take us to all the different wards where we're going to identify the most needy, hand out the coupons and then they'll come to the car and collect their bag. We're about to go into the tuberculosis ward, so we've been asked to wear masks and that we can't breathe anything in or catch anything. So we're about to go into the medical male ward and there's some prisoners in there that come from the prison and if the prison can't um, take care of them. They've got a, a clinic in the prison and it's for outpatients. So here, if they've got something that's really bad, they come to this hospital. So we're just about to go inside and see them. and don't have anyone to help them so some of the other ones try and help them um, yeah so it, it's quite sad but some of them are mentally ill as well so it's a lot going on here but um, hopefully this bag will help them So we've got all the people together and they're going to give the bags to all their patients that we've given coupons to. We're just getting all the bags out of the car and we're going to hand them out. Some of the patients who are able to walk have come, but those who are no, unable to come and collect their bags, the nurses are going to distribute them to them.
Okay. Come, come, come. But we are going to go. Okay. Well, we Now we're in the villages, um, we're just about to go and see the people in their homes and give them and give them raffles and with the raffle they can come to the parish hall tomorrow and get their stuff.
Take joy, my King. 